What's going on guys, Phil here from Phil's Craft Corner and we're back with a, another workshop Wednesday. I've got some work to do in the workshop today, but first I need to tidy everything up. I've got to break these pallets down for another order and uh, I have these to cut out. These are handbags that end up like this when they're all finished and then hopefully uh, we should have a good day. It's going to take me a couple hours to get everything ready and tidy and sorted out and then we can cut these out and I've also got a fish tank lid to make so that should be today's jobs uh, it's not going to be a super interesting workshop Wednesday I've not got anything really interesting to do tidy up, cut the pallets down hopefully it should be done for the day go home, get a nice hot bath and relax so I hope you're all having a good day so let's get into it and crack on Alright guys, as you can see, I've uh, pretty much done clean workshop, I just need to get a bit of the floor done. I only did three of the pallets because it's an absolute nightmare to break down pallets. Uh, this Euro pallet and the Shep pallet, um, I'll probably send a message to somebody to try and get this Shep pallet picked up because they're uh, owned by Shep. Uh, the Euro pallets, they are ridiculously strong to break down so just don't even bother with these, they just take too long. These are ones underneath, I'll probably do another day. Uh, all the pallet wood is just stored up there for now. It's just a little temporary rack that I shoved up there just to help get some storage. This wire is going to be because that was just charging the camera that was up there so I could get a time lapse of the whole workshop. Uh, these bits of MDF, I need to figure out what I'm going to do with those because I did have them up there where my 
door hoarding is getting a bit out of hand and just staying up there. The reason I've got doors up there is I use them like this uh, with my track saw and I put them down and I cut the material on here and it, it just helps give a better cut and it makes it a lot safer so uh, I normally have a workbench across here with that door on top of and then I use my track saw to cut sheet materials down just makes it safer and easier and a scrap door is not bad to be cutting into but I did do some adulting I have bought myself just pan a brush and a new brush uh, I left my brush at a property uh, probably about three months ago now and I've just been annoying myself trying to clean up the workshop and hoover it up and I keep meaning to get one and I keep forgetting and then I completely destroyed my old dustpan and brush by crushing it with a car seat when I was moving them and I didn't realise it was there so I spent a whole four pounds three pounds ninety eight on a new dustpan and brush and a new brush and I'm not gonna lie I'm quite excited to be able to sweep my floor I did have the old one for about four years. Four years, yeah. Um, I bought, I got them when I moved into my old workshop, and I've had them in this workshop for three years. Yeah, four years. Um, so they did all right. Four years for a dustpan and brush, and hopefully I can get the same amount out of these. So what I'm going to do for the rest of today is I am going to sweep this floor. I'm going to get tidy. I've got to go and pop and do a repair at somebody's property, and. Then I need to go and help my sister move some stuff and take it to the tip. So I don't think I'm going to get the bags cut out today. I'm going to try and get the fish tank lid because I did say I'd get that done today. Um, but today or tomorrow, both of them things will be done. So that's probably it for this week's workshop. Wednesday again, just me tidying up and talk about what I've been up to. So thanks for watching guys if you want to follow along with more stuff that I'm doing if you're interested in anything else just ask me about it I will talk to you about it in the comments if you like this video give us a thumbs up and just please hit that subscribe button and follow along with more videos hopefully I'll do something a bit more fun for you something that you like watching and uh, I will see you in the next one cheers guys